did the Dolphins overpay to resign to a, It depends on who you ask. Um, I think as football fans, we have to get over and stop using the word overpaid. Because when you say overpaid, you are, you are insinuating that I'm not getting what I pay for. And if you being completely honest, Patrick Mahomes might be the only one that's worth a big contract. And in, 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 in if you're talking Super Bowl and AFC championships and all pros and pro bowls and all of that, okay? Unfortunately, Patrick Mahomes going to stop a lot of people from getting the, getting the Super Bowl. That's just how it is. Lamar Jackson... Um, Josh Allen, those guys are consistently in the playoffs. And people, some people say they overpaid. How are they overpaid? I don't think today their worth to their franchises is what matters. Everybody's not going to win the Super Bowl. If Lamar ends his career or Josh Allen's in their career and they don't win the Super Bowl, I don't think that means they were a failure. They just happen to play in the era of Patrick Mahomes. You got to sneak you a title. But I don't. I'm not a Dolphins fan, so I can look at them and say, all right, yeah, they overpaid. But Dolphins fans, who is the Dolphins going to get better than than Tua? Brock Purdy, y'all, if y'all mad at Tua getting overpaid, y'all really about to get mad at Brock Purdy. Because he about to get he about to get paid, and that's just the market for quarterback. Because you can't teach dog. You can't teach that I told you. You can't teach this. That dog either.